So I got a few more flyers, maybe like 15 or 16 left. Here in Englewood, across from Roscoe's Chicken and Waffles. As you can see right there, Roscoe's House of Chicken and Waffles. But I did drop some flyers off here uh, the other morning. And Operational. Sorry, I'm just trying to review a flyer. Thank you. The last one. Again, here in Inglewood, California. Today is the 11th of October, as you can see. Again, that's Roscoe's. Roscoe's House of Chicken and Waffles here in Inglewood, California. Everybody is having a good morning, and uh, yeah, today is the 11th of October here in Inglewood. Got some flyers. Going out. And because I remember dropping some off here the other day.
design systems. Space travel tour as well. Just a few of the places that I dropped off my flyer with uh, my graduation announcement, I guess, maybe less than two weeks ago. I'm back from graduation, it was on the 5th, today's the 11th. Anyway, we're still trying to end homelessness, we wanted to bring attention to it um, in all cultures because notice that we're trying to end homelessness for all, that includes all cultures, all places on earth. As you can see, if you go to my website, thank you. Kind of awkward trying to do this with the camera. Holding a camera in one hand. California. Today is the 11th.
that gonna be one, two, three, four left. It should be 6 a.m. now. The caddy. Olive Street here in Inglewood, California. Devon, what? Yeah, uh huh. That's me. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Okay, so let's get a couple more, a couple. I have three more. We want to end homelessness for all. Maybe six, eight, then. Good morning, I just wanted to leave you a flyer. Oh, okay. Have a good day. You get, what's that? I'm sorry? She said it's too early for that. Oh yeah, the guy said it's too early for that. Oh my goodness, it is a little bit early, it's 6 a.m. I guess everybody doesn't have to be at work at 9 a.m. or 6 a.m. in the morning, but I am. You, as you can see, um, yeah, that's that fog in front of the light that's moving. That's what you might call the marine layer. You would also experience that in San Francisco. And it's because we're so close to the ocean, perhaps because we're in a Mediterranean climate as well. Well, Los Angeles is nearly a desert at 14 inches per year on average. Uh, it will have to be 10 or under 10 inches to be a desert, which Los Angeles County does have 
a couple cities that are in the desert uh, Lancaster and Palmdale where I'll be in a couple days but uh yeah so um it doesn't rain much here but here in the fall as the season has just changed we're almost a month into the fall what's the day the 11th now we're maybe 10 days off from being a month since it's changed from summer to fall and i noticed the difference is well you don't have a lot of you do have some leaves falling just like in colorado last year at the change it's different than the than many of the eastern states and even in washington and oregon here i suppose on the west coast more maybe green forested states versus these air, uh, arid less rainy states um, but you still have here particularly maybe not in, definitely not in Colorado it's not there's no ocean there but here you have a different climate zone being uh, tropical and you have this morning fog or we might call it a marine layer so that started happening I noticed not that it wasn't happening before but um, in the mornings particularly like you can see the mist blowing versus times where I saw it before it was like a cloud over covering certain mountains like the St. Gabriel Mountains or the Los Angeles National Forest or um, what is it? Uh, or the um, Los Angeles National Forest. And so, um, let's just leave this here. That's my last one for today. But, um, yeah, so you sometimes you'll see that mist or that fog covering in there like you'll have you can see like certain days um i could see clearly the like the national forest from the distance but another day it, it was completely invisible because it's covered by a a cloud of fog or some might call it a marine layer or that's what my thing calls it so Today is the 11th, and we're trying to end homelessness. I'm at it early, as you can see.